right here is 4003 Dolphin. This is a big size house on a double lot. Here's the Thomas Rack. You can see cars driving by there. And that's the Regents Towers. There's a guard here. So again, this goes all the way up to the, basically the next house. That's the gate to go to the back. Um, and they replaced a portion of the roof in the front and then the back hasn't been replaced. However, if you go all the way to the end of Dolphin Drive, you may be able to see from here there is access boat ramp. It's a public boat ramp to the uh, Grand Lagoon. Currently there is no, um, they, they try to work on the central AC, There's, it's not running right now. Um, and then it does need to be updated for sure. But it is a block house. So this is the houses around it. It's a very popular neighborhood now. Just gonna go ahead and take you over inside. Here we have the kitchen. Laundry room. Here's the electric panel. I should get treats out of my car for you. I'll do that. <laughs> I usually carry it. There's a hallway bathroom right here. All right. So um, three bedrooms are on this end of the house. So here's bedroom number one. Bedroom number two. This hall used to be a bathroom. But this, this is where the master bathroom is hiding behind this wall now. So, and then this would be the master uh, bedroom here. This area of the beach is on public water. There is no public sewer. It's uh, they're all on um, septic tank. However, this is a quite busy street, so I'll try to find out from the city if um, it's possible to connect to the um, public sewer, city sewer, which may not be doable for this area. But again, this is not complete as a bathroom. It just basically just has been has the walls and that's it. So this, if I go back outside of the bedroom, the master bedroom, this actually is right here, uh, an apartment on its own. Um, so you can either close it out here, put a wall up, and then not have access to it from the main part of the house, or you can leave the door. But the way you, you can, obviously we can get to it through the opening there, or if I also go back out through the back door, out of the master bedroom, I'll show you the backyard. So the backyard is, is a really big, good sized backyard, especially for this part of the beach. As you see the roof, this is the part of the roof that's older and it requires replacement. It's a huge backyard, it goes all the way around.
Okay. And then this part of the this is also belongs to this part of the um, parcel because this sits on the big double lot, huge lot. So it looks like again this is a concrete block and then they may have added this portion later on. You can see this is T11 here. So I'm just going to walk around and show you the street on this side. Nice neighborhood. Right by the beach, by the boat ramp. And then the Buster's uh, bar right here on the corner of Tom's Drive and Dolphin. So you can have this as a separate uh, mother-in-law rental unit or whatnot because it has its own small backyard patio sort. So this would be a, a living area. It's a, it's a pretty big size living room. So that's the opening to the kitchen. Here, let me walk around. There's the kitchen, and again, it's a good size kitchen as well. This is the utility room, has a water heater. Apparently there's water heaters, there's only one that feeds the entire house. And it's the smaller one. It's probably 40 gallon. And then that's the bedroom. And its own bathroom. So basically this is going to make it four bedroom, three full bathroom. Or it could be three bedroom, two bathhouse with a separate one bedroom with a kitchen and a separate bathroom apartment. So that's the way you can go back outside through the main part of the house. Back into the living room.